Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Let's Play Greg Block. Greg Block is a Skyblock Greg Tech 1.12 mod pack and <laughs> yeah, uh, it's a bit crazy to be honest uh, if you think about it. Greg Tech and Skyblocks, y you think people have gone a little too far at this point, but we're going to give it a try. I don't know how successful we are. We've done uh, Greg Tech before. I think I was one of the very few that did GTNH uh, Let's Play series in English anyways. Um, I'm not the best Greg Tech player. I was way better five, six plus years ago. I was really far did Let's Play series. Greg himself used to watch all the time, but uh, we're going to give it a try. It might last very short, but we're going to go ahead and do it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to more options here. We're going to turn cheats on. Um, this is just kind of standard in case if something goes wrong, something blows up, and you have to, you know, fix it through creative mode or uh, through a command or whatever. So uh, the only way around that, if you did forget, is, well, you can modify, I guess, the NBT data or whatever on the, the, the level dot dat, or you can put the game into land mode, and then I believe then you can do cheat mode uh, through that. So this will be interesting. Like I said, this is a skyblock, so uh, I'm not even good at those uh, to begin with. So <laughs> we will have some fun. There will be a, probably a bit of grinding at first because, uh, you know, skyblocks tend to be grindy. So I think they have a, uh, excavate on here or something like that. So you just hold down uh, your squiggly key um, on the uh, left side of your keyboard there beside the one. And we're going to go ahead and take this dirt as well there we go and we got a book here so let's check it out uh, everything to know uh, the manual ages okay so uh, I guess this is the start so uh, items in your inventory are checked every three seconds so wait at least three seconds okay so that's for the quest stuff we go back um, I, I assume that quest book gets pretty taxing at times. You know, if you had like 40 people on with like inventory, I'd assume that all that taking might be a little heavy at times. Uh, so here we go. So uh, keep in mind, this is uh, unfortunately not my favorite type, but uh, this one isn't all on one page, but rather broken down into parts on the page. So you got to get oak wood, then oak wood planks and crafting table. So keep in mind, you, there's a scroll, you know, you have to go through it. So... Um, you know, pay attention to the instructions. It did say that, uh, you know, you got to keep the items in your inventory for, you know, a, f a couple seconds just to make sure you get the reward or you might just have to redo something if you don't. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and just throw that right here. There we go. And, uh, okay. And then, yeah, everything's happy looking. So I think the, oh yeah, there it is. So the twerk mod is on here. So that just lets you kind of Get things a little faster. Did I get my apple? Oh, we did get my apple. I thought maybe my apple went flying. Not getting lots of bone, uh, sorry, uh, saplings yet, but hopefully we can get a little more over time. So basically you just twerk, twerk, twerk. There you go. Oh yeah, we got lots of saplings there. I feel a little more comfortable when you get a bunch of saplings, right? And then over time, you can take the wood and make, uh, you know, before we go into anything, you can go ahead and make your wood slabs, you know. There's some things I remember that you're supposed to do, and you put them down. Don't do them uh, all the way, because if you put them all the way, uh, or sorry, don't put them up here, like uh, on the second layer. Uh, matching the height of the current uh, dirt because then mobs can spawn but the idea is mobs can't spawn on this so um, you, you're kind of protecting yourself and I'm sure there's like a builder wand and things like that in this pack I actually haven't looked to be honest but uh, oh here you go builders wand okay well stone plate stone tool <laughs> oh man there's files related I forgot this is Greg Tech Greg Tech holy crap like I said, I'm, I'm getting us started. I can't promise you this series is going to go far, but uh, we're giving it we're giving it a shot here anyways. Uh, I'm a caregiver full time in life, and uh, I just don't have as much time as I used to. I mean, like, don't get me wrong. I'm playing lots of games here and there, uh, but the, the, the more harder concentrated, you know, user brain games kind of, uh, they get to you. And uh, I used to laugh at my friend. He's like, I'm like, why are you playing some FPS game? After he comes, what the heck? Okay, that is so cool. Can I do that on anything? No, you can lift up your uh, your thing with shift right click. <laughs> but uh, you know, he he's to um, 
you know, come home and play like an FPS, you know, even if it's Call of Duty, you know, that's not one of my favorite games ever out there. Uh, but, you know, and I say, why are you playing that? Why don't you play like, you know, modded Minecraft with me or something like that? And, you know, he would refuse. He's like, uh, you know, I get paid to work. Why would I come home and work? And, you know, I always thought, oh, what an ass. <laughs> But I honestly, I kind of understand a bit more now. Uh, as the years have gone by, I do kind of understand the statement. I mean, when you get home, sometimes you're tired, you're worn out, and you just don't have the, you know, the brain function or power to do, do certain tasks like, you know, figure out why the heck your liquid something in Greg Tech isn't working, maybe, you know. So, um, you know, it, you get more understanding as you get older anyways, so. So we've done enough planks for now. So if you hit F7, yep, they have it on here. Uh, you can see that mobs can spawn here, but they can't spawn on the half slabs, and that's the whole point of it. And if you hit F9, you can see your chunks. So uh, it looks like this starts right in the middle of the chunk-ish. Uh, keep in mind, chunks are even, so there is no never a center on a block. Rather, it be in, in between all the blocks, because it's 16 by 16, if I recall. So there we go. So we're going to twerk, 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 twerk. So there'll probably be some other interesting things in our book that we're supposed to uh, be working on next here. Let's just get uh, some more wood first. There we go. And this also will help just prevent a few items from flying off uh, off the cliff. Okay, so we can claim our trophy. Uh, here's your little trophy. I'm not going to place it down right now because we probably can't. This is Greg Tech, you have to remember. So we probably can't even mine the trophy up. Um, actually, I, I could understand why. Yeah, I don't even think you can pick that up. It says axe. It says we could do it. So I don't know if we really can or not. But either way, Greg Tech gets pretty hardcore in certain blocks of breaking them. Uh, so we have a few options here. You have the wooden crock. Uh, so the wooden crock, I'm pretty sure, is just the old recipe. I don't think this was made into, like, this isn't like, uh, sorry, this isn't like um, GT New Horizon where, you know, even making a cookie is going to be costing you your life. It's Greg Tech style hardness. So uh, it's not going to be like, y y that's it. Your life is gone. Okay, sorry about that. So we're going to go ahead and chop that down. So you get a bunch of worms. You kind of use up your crock. You could hold on to it if you want uh, and put multiple crocks together. But, uh, I mean, it took every last ounce, basically. So I don't see the point, honestly. You just get a little extra, you know, a little extra back and it's just not worth it to me. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. And that intro music, man, scared the crap out of me when I first saw it. Or heard it. I saw the music. I could see it, guys. Okay, so uh, there we go. We can get rid of those crocs for now. And we'll take you down. And uh, we're probably ready for just an apple here. So you, you get a little extra saturation from the apple. And, uh, okay. Yeah, I don't think they have any kind of food. The food thing's not popping up, at least for me. So that's that's good. So let's go in here, and that's it. They're, they they complete. It looks like they're not going to baby you with free items here and there. Maybe just trophies, maybe some other stuff. But so far, it looks like uh, it's pretty uh, fair. What is this one? Everything you need to know about quests. Oh, okay. What's this one? You can use sieves and meshes to obtain resources. You can sift the 5x5 five five of sieves, provide that they are the same mesh. You can put... Inventory is on top of the sieve to automatically collect the outputs. Put inventories on top of the sieves. But when it automatically collect the sieving outputs, but how do you sieve if it's on top? I, I mean, I'm not really good at this stuff, but it's kind of kind of weird if you think about it, right? Uh, okay, so manual age, we got that. And uh, you got your silkworms. You got your string. Actually, uh, that's, I guess, our next task here we can do. The string is just, uh, whoop. there you go. Oh, hello. So you can just put these worms on it, and basically over time they multiply, they spread like uh, a disease. And you can see they'll, they'll start to go other blocks. I don't know if they have to hit 100% first, or, you no, know, it looks like they're spreading already. So, yeah, there you go. So it's kind of probably best just to throw them around, just because you get a little more opportunity with them. Now, I don't know if you should use a crock with this, but uh, I'll give it a try anyways. 
So you can see we're getting less materials from this. That's a Greg Tech thing. That's not like a, oh, you're playing a hard mode. That's just how Greg Tech always was that you'd get like half the resources because you're supposed to use like a, a saw or a sawmill or a saw. I think they even have like a hand saw and stuff like that. But uh, it's like a Christmas tree. So you can see them converting. Just wait for a few more to fully convert. Sounds wrong when I say that. We're waiting for the conversion. There you go. Okay, we're probably pretty close now to being done. There you go, so you get your string, 57th string. Not bad, not bad. And so we're done that quest. And the next one is uh, dirt. Uh, or you can do cobblestone. I guess cobblestone's next. And uh, so your wooden barrel. So you put your stuff in the dirt in there. Okay. And uh, so, or sorry, you don't put dirt in it, but you uh, you get dirt out of it. So I guess what we do now is wooden barrel. There it is. So pretty simple recipe there. Uh, I guess we'll just go like this. Doot, doot. I guess we'll make a couple for now. I don't know if I really need a couple, but... Uh, We'll do it. And I guess I'll put it on the outside. I don't know why, but it seems more dangerous. So it's like, I don't know why, but I'm going to do it because I'm in for the danger. Now, can I put string in here? Oh, cool. So string might be actually a, a worthwhile material. I lost half of it there, but uh, at the same time, I can get two dirts with the string, or maybe even a bit more. Of course, you want the string for sieving as well, right? But uh, just stating the fact that might work well doing uh, string for that. Okay, and then you're probably going to want to do more trees here. So there you go. That's composing, decomposing. Come on, you horrible thingy. We're going to probably need some more string, especially since I just wasted some, but uh, there you go. Okay. So I think this kind of pops into your inventory anyway. So there you go. So we got two dirt. We've we've invented and created dirt. Oh, this is cool. I didn't realize that. Oh, it moves towards where you are. Oh, that's so adorable. <laughs> Will you put them over here? Hello. I'm having too much fun screwing around with this. <laughs> okay. Um, I wonder actually how a bed is made. I mean, is it just wool? Yeah, it's wool still string. Yeah, so honestly, when this is finished, I can make a bed and make it daytime and not have to worry about uh, a full night. So something to keep in mind. Oh, that crock is almost done. So let's go ahead and make ourselves another crock here. There we go. How are you guys doing? Are you pretty much done? I think so. Oh, I saw something. Give it another couple seconds here. I don't see any movement now, so we'll assume most of it's done. So let's go ahead and uh, there you go. And so one, two, three. Ah, oh, I can't space it out of there. I guess something I'm used to is not there. And there you go. So here's our bed. You probably don't want to put right on the edge, to be honest, just in case. But uh, there you go. Don't know how it would work on a half slab also. So <laughs> ta-da. There you go. And it's daytime. And then you kind of rinse and repeat, of course. So I guess the next thing is probably a sieve now. Uh, so sieve is probably where you're going to get cobblestone so sieve uh you can look at the basic sieve first and see how we do it recipe wise so you're going to need uh, a few materials here you're going to need your planks your slab and some sticks and the sieve is kind of like uh well this is where you get most of your material from for a while anyways i should say i don't know can oh i can pick this up too they have that mod on there um let's go ahead and break this slab even if i lose it there you go I just want to put this right here. There you go. Actually, will things fall through the bottom of it? 
oh, that might not be a good idea now I think about it. Okay, we're, we're aborting that idea. I don't know if things fall out of the bottom of it. I just don't want to ch take a chance. Okay, and then I guess the next one's probably a mesh. Yeah, a string mesh. Okay, they have them together on that one. I like that. Okay, so we got the string mesh here. So I guess we're not in this crafting inventory. There you go. Now, I don't know if these have a durability. I really miss my space. What is this? Clear grid. Okay, I could do that more. Uh, so there you go. And uh, you can pop. Oh, I think you can replace. I don't know exactly how. Or maybe you can't. And uh, yeah, so we're done. And then cobblestone. Oh, I guess that's the next page. Stone pebbles. So you feed, I guess, dirt through this. And eventually you'll get stone pebbles and other things. Oh, God. And other things, keep in mind. I'm going to do wood just because I don't want to do more. Okay. Oh, God. I got even more stuff. So we got our pebbles. Uh, so we have to make the cobblestone. And uh, let's see here, my friends. Where are we? There we go. So we can make four cobblestones. <laughs> You're richer than you think. And made it to Stone Age. There you go. So the next task is a furnace and four uh, of that. So I might as well just eat away from our dirt for now. You could, if you want, use more dirt from that you've gotten before. Because uh, you can see that uh, we got, what, nine pieces still there? But I think I'm going to keep them there for now, just in case. You know, like an emergency. Uh, so we got, uh, how many pebbles did we get that time? I think we just got enough. Yeah, I think it was 16 you needed, right? There you go. Ooh. And then we can make a furnace. Ooh. We're badass now. Okay. How awesome is that? And you could probably do the... Can I do the... Oh, I can't on that one, it looks like. So we got ourselves a furnace. And right off the bat, there's like a, a mining one there. We won't do that right away. There's the smash one. So this lets you smash and make gravel, sand. So you're going downwards, basically. Uh, and that makes it so you can sieve different materials. If you look at the sieve here, I don't know if it's going to be here. Uh, well, actually, this probably is a good recipe anyways. So you can see if you sieve gravel... Uh, this is an electric sieve, but still gives you an idea. You got gravel. You can do actual leaves. So you can see that if you sieve the leaves, you'll get some of this stuff. Pretty cool, huh? And then probably the same thing for the barrel. I don't know if it's uh, a different interface or if it has something. But, uh, okay, it's fill and top, transform, uh, fluid block, and compost. There you go. So here's your compost. Everything you see here can be composted. So... Uh, so your, your saplings, etc. And it tells you, I guess, how much you need of each. So worms, you need 25 cooked worms or raw worms. I don't know if that's cooked or raw. No, 25 worms that are cooked, 25 uncooked, 25 string. But you can see melons are a little cheaper. Wheat is a little cheaper. Uh, you know. That is cool, actually. Okay, let's check our list here. So, mob farm, water. Uh, so, you need an oak crucible for water. So, crucible. There you go. And we're going to eat some wood for that. We might as well uh, plant another tree. Hello. Wait, wait. Was there saplings on that thing? I don't even know if I noticed the saplings. Okay. Uh, so, we'll make the, the, the crucible here. And over time, this will produce water, which, of course, water is great. Oh. That was not what I meant to do. There you go. It blended in so well. So over time, this can produce water naturally, I think, if it rains. That's what I think it is. If it rains, you can get water naturally. Um, but you can put sapling uh, leaves or saplings in here. Um, I don't know when we will get saplings directly because I feel like we'll eventually need to make something for that. Uh, so here you go. You got let me smash clay uh looks like tier one the shifting basic tools uh squids oh that's for water so i guess if you have water placed over time squids can uh, show up so let's go ahead and uh let's place some of these guys in here oh that's not too bad i think that's enough for a bucket of water oh well it might be a little over but i think maybe that's the case for this so there you go this will fill up over time okay and so we can say we've 
accomplish that. Uh, so yeah, the next one is Lemmy Smash Stonehammer. Uh, Stonehammer. Which I assume, yeah, you're going to need a bunch of cobblestone for that as well. So this is when you're like, well, I don't get this much dirt. And it's probably true. Probably don't get that much dirt at all. Uh, you got some seeds, though. You can start growing your wheat, right? Uh, actually, that kind of makes things interesting. Uh, when can I build a hoe, I wonder? Or can I build a hoe? You need gravel and, yeah, so we don't have that yet. But I wonder what gravel, yeah. Let's see, gravel is mortar and pastel, so cobblestone. Or is that smooth stone? That might be smooth stone. So a wee bit yet, unfortunately. Uh, we can also make some. You guys, what's the value on you guys? Let's see, and you can hit F3H to turn off the advanced tooltips if you didn't know that. Oh, you guys are evil. Oh, let me guess. You can't make charcoal, period. That's probably one of the things. <laughs> uh, I love this. Uh, okay, so I guess really it's uh, back to growing stuff. You might want to start uh, just moving around the uh, and placing more uh, dirt around. We could probably even move the bed, honestly. I just I, I do get worried, but I guess if we're going to... Yeah, I guess I'll put it here. Oh, you can't even actually put it there right now. Um, let's go ahead and put this extended I'm going to extend this but we won't sleep on it till we extend the uh, the platform but there you go I'm not taking the risk you know sleeping on that but I'm trying to give us a, a bit of extra room uh, to work here okay so let's go ahead and take that out excellent and do it again yeah I think with clay you need to oh that's a Christmas surprise right here. Except the downside to this is you're not going to get it all. Keep that in mind. I mean, I'd actually, why am I, I, I guess hitting the tree won't change what I get, will it? I keep thinking it will, but honestly, oh God, so much of it fell over. Oh, oh, the shame. But we got a lot of wood, so we could correct that up for the future here. Uh, which reminds me, uh, chests are the same. Awesome. So you probably want to make a chest to store some of your items, which is probably good too, because if you die, especially, you know, getting riskier here. Uh, let's see here. Um, I'll just put it here, I guess, for now. There you go. I guess you can just do it like that. There you go. And then you can go like this. Awesome. Yeah, I missed my inventory tweaks. I'm not sure why I can't space anymore. Auto refill, middle click, shortcuts off. Is that what was screwing me up? Yeah. Uh, sometimes it does screw up too. Maybe they turn that off because sometimes you can drop items out of your inventory, things like that. But for my sake, I'm putting the shortcuts back on on inventory tweaks just because that's my my thing. So what I will do from now to the next episode is basically I will uh, eat this. I will probably get more worms just to cook uh, cook reasons. And I think they could cook. Let's see here. Ah, yes. So you can you can cook with your planks. And the worms might give you a bit more. I don't know. What does this do? Two and one... Two and one... One point two something. Oh, it's the same. It's the same. So just use what you can, I guess. There you go. But uh, I will get more... Uh, basically more worms and I will get more string, more everything. I'll get more cobblestone and then we'll go from there. And uh, yeah, so thank you guys and girls so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see you wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.